Hello everyone, this is Ron from High Tech Legion and this is an ICDOC MB882HX-1SB SSD expander. What this product does is it allows you to expand the storage capabilities of your SSD by combining it with a regular mechanical hard drive. It basically extends it up to twice the size while, while the remaining uh, disk space inside your mechanical drive is still usable unlike other hybrid expanders and uh, basically explains it here right underneath the bottom and at the back a table of specifications and the compatibility compatibilities of what it is uh, attached to such as the 2.5 inch SATA 2 SSD and a SATA 2 hard disk drive it is made of plastic and it's very light that's about 125 grams and use a SATA interface and uh, see here uh, some more features as anti-vibration and easy access and uh, as mentioned the SATA 3 uh, gigabyte per second interface basically here a quick uh, illustrated uh, guide of how to use it it's basically combine the SATA with your mechanical drive and if you plug it in like that with the I'm assuming the provided cables inside you will produce the hybrid SSD and hard disk drive hybrid drive Let's open up the box. You can see what the package contains. Okay. Um, which you have the enclosure. Make sure nothing is left inside the box. And the one end is taped. You can see there is a silica gel in there to prevent moisture from affecting the Electric components. Let's first take out the contents and put away the packaging. And you have the documentation. Now, this is actually a lot thicker and more detailed than uh, regular ICDoc product documentation. It comes in multiple languages, but the English is actually uh, seven pages long. Details how to set it up and install it. And here is the enclosure where you'll put it in. It is similar in um, form factor to other uh, ICDOC products like the 2.5 inch or 3.5 inch adapter that they have. The uh, MB881U3 1SB, if I recall correctly. And uh, basically open it by sliding it down like this. You can see at the top there's a, as it says, close and open. It's, uh, Slide it up. See if we can. It's hard to open up. And the MB882HX-1SB is similar in form factor to a 3.5 inch drive. In fact, the mounting holes are line up uh, to the side, and they line up perfectly. Here at the back, you can see the SATA connectors also line up. And uh, here at the top, see a ventilation hole and the ICDOC logo with the open and closing marks. See the close has an arrow pointing up and the open is uh, pointing down. Right, let's try to open it up. Uh, just simply press down and push forward. The entire top is actually removable. See there's some uh, plastic anti vibration part right here. And inside, you'll find mounting screws and your uh, SATA cable. It's a short SATA cable actually for connecting the hard drive to the MB882HX-1SB itself. And in here, you can see the uh, PCB. Uh, it's a custom ICDOC PCB. Um, I'm assuming what it does is it actually it, uh, it does a raid of your hard drive and SSD but it allows the remaining uh, partition to be usable on the drive. So um, let's see what is what else is in this MB882HX-1SP. In here you can find a ventilation hole for uh, exhausting, rather uh, intaking cool air to cool down the drive inside. And here at the back there are also more exhaust holes. Here is the 
is basically a mechanic to uh, a mechanism to hold down the drive in place and to install a drive. Just uh, see the SATA connectors there. Make sure you take your SSD and align it in place. Make sure you align the SATA connectors. And then you can push it down. Now uh, what I'm using here is a SATA 3, uh, 6 gigabyte per second Force 3 Corsair SSD, but the SATA, the IC dock MB882HX-1SB is actually limited to SATA 2. So preferably you should use a, an older uh, an older generation SSD, this is a third generation SSD, SSD is a SATA, right, a SATA 2, generation 2 or generation 1 SSD where the MB882HX-1SB will benefit the most. And uh, after that, just simply close it back down. And follow the guide, it says close, put it this way, and simply lock it in place. Now after that, you attach your mechanical hard drive into your IC dock MB882HX-1SB using the cable provided. The SATA connector onto your drive and attach it to the rear of your IC dock SSD expander. Of course you still need to power on the hard drive and the uh, hybrid expander itself so you should plug in a 4 pin rather a SATA power connector and a SATA power connector to the hybrid adapter and uh, should take a SATA 2 connector plug it into that SATA connector and plug it into your motherboard. Once you do that you should see that the entire setup will be seen as a single drive.